Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your April 2019 general reading. It's a general reading so it will not resonate with each and every Libra who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Thank you to those who've already done so. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to use the Starman Tarot if anybody, you know, cares to know. Um, let's see what's going on with my Libras. Some of you, like, took a hiatus for, from a career path, from something you were doing consistently. You needed to focus on you. You needed rest and relaxation uh, in your life. So you just took a break or you're taking a break. Um, some of you may be just resting. A rejuvenating and then you'll jump back into it you were full force full on and then uh, now you just kind of took a break uh, let's see Hold on for my labors. so most times these readings are about love uh, career finance can come up here and there but you know most people want to come look at tarot card readings in regards to love. You know, so I really, I don't control it. Let's see what's going on with my labors. The bottom of the deck, get the five of wands. So we've got some indecision. Some unrest in a situation. They may, they may, it might even be competition. You may be competing for something or putting yourself in a place where you, um, yeah, you have to win or, or win over. Let's see. The star might be dealing with an Aquarius person. If not, it just talks about what I would, was talking about when I, I was shuffling the cards about. You, you stop and taking rest, healing, rejuvenation, uh, pouring back into yourself, getting some clarity uh, as to what you should be doing, what path you should be taking. Then the hangman, I mean, you could be dealing with a Piscean person. If not, you're at a place of kind of just letting things move along as they are. You're not doing too much. Animated uh, suspension. Just kind of watching life. Not really overreacting or um, interacting. Okay. The Nine of Wands. Uh, you, so this is a Libra that's looking at a situation from afar. And evaluating what should I do. This could be in regards to career and finance, love and romance. I've separated myself, keep in mind, because our nines talk about separation from a taxing or trying, troublesome situation, relationship. And now I am evaluating it from afar. You could also have a secret admirer, Libra, um, someone who feels as if you are the perfect match, you're the perfect person. They are in animated suspension in regards to coming toward you let's see that that's one interpretation you get in where you fit in nine of pentacles nice uh you're at a place of abundance you've built up a life you would like a life partner that would be the ten of pentacles you're at a place of just um waiting being you're separated from what you feel is foundational you th you you know that you've done a lot in regards to building yourself up some of you this is business and finance some of you are restless in your current position because of uh, a business opportunity that's in your mind and you might be evaluating moving away from separating there's a lot of separation uh, in regards to the your actions and then what you're doing with your everyday assets and your money or what is tangible you are you're thinking of the long term let's see the prince of wands 
some of you just may be thinking of, of making a real hasty move toward some of you are really thinking about going after your your what you're passionate about what you desire but there may be some competition some of you are putting in for petitions or or grants or you you're trying to gain or win over something so that you can move forward in this business opportunity or 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 new job you're on the correct path here if not this is just how someone sees you Libra as independent abundant um without partner and they feel as if you're the perfect person perfect partner for them and they want to move toward you passionately be Aries Sagittarius Leo Aquarius Pisces Taurus let's see what's going on here what six of pentacles yeah so right now you you feel like you need to make a decision of where to come continue to invest and in doing so you're going to have to separate depart from divorce from one arena in your life now this if this isn't career and finance then it's i'm departing from a and going to b if it's in relationship i'm departing from uh, one person I'm no longer giving to two parties energetically monetarily all of that I am going to decide to give to one party by way of divorcing separating because my heart has been torn in regards to me dividing my energy effort time and money I have to make a decision about this business. Some of you do two things. Like you have a full time job, or you have a career, then you have a business on the side. Let's see. Ace of Cups. It says, now if this is in love, then this, this is a Libra who is, uh, there may be problems in your marriage. This could be a second marriage or a second relationship. You may decide to divorce. There will be new love or friendship or there is. If this is in career and finance, then the, the cards indicate that you should go after what fulfills you on a soul level. You're emotionally. Uh, because your emotions are connected to the tangible also. If you don't have any money, you, you kind of feel depleted emotionally. So, go after what completes you on an emotional... Right. Because you're... And you're hesitating before making decisions. And you know that you need to. With the Five of Cups here. Crying over spilled milk. I didn't make enough money in this... Whatever business. Or whatever. Or I didn't get enough love in this relationship. Yet, I'm still focused on it. When I need to turn around and understand that there's something that fulfills me on a soul level okay so we know that Libra is at a place of needing to make a decision in regards to either career and finance or a relationship that just doesn't fulfill anymore you may even be giving yourself to two parties dividing your energy effort time your love what is the advice for Libra? So we're going to get some advice here. Seven of Wands. Knight of Wands. Ten of Swords. 
bottom of the deck eight of swords so this speaks of you need to gain control of this situation by way of standing your ground you already have the thought you've already done the action of defending this or trying to make it work and it's an uphill battle so you may need to expeditiously change courses here make the move make a move toward what fulfills you on a passionate level what drives you what could you do every day even if you weren't getting compensation for it because the ten of swords is here it whatever the situation is it's already it just can't get any worse it's already been worse it's already been bad it's already done it's already over and you keep putting energy and effort time into a situation where you feel stuck eight of swords not seeing clearly not seeing a way out needing to maybe reduce to the seven of swords devise a plan of action in secret this is your plan no one else's to move forward to jump to the ten of swords to end it completely end it okay so if that's in love that's in love what we're going to do is pull some butterfly oracle cards no angel answers and then We'll clarify over the other side. Also do another mini spread in regards to, let's see if we can pick up some more energy for any other Libras out there. Uh, let's see. You want to tell Libra from the angel answers. Forgiveness. Peaceful, resol peaceful resolution and yes if this doesn't go with what we've been talking about yes peaceful resolution and forgiveness okay and we're going to clarify over the other side all right um and then let's see what the butterfly oracle cards in regards to this reading has to say for libra get a potential outcome also so we have the advice that you need to um, you need to stand your ground in regards to what it is you want to do what it is you're passionate about and stop allowing you know other things to distract you uh, you need to make an expeditious move toward whatever it is you want to do um, and, and let the ending happen Wow these three fell out of the deck for Libra. Wow. Healthcare change. And we talked about that in the beginning. The need for rest, relaxation. Get a second, third opinion in regards to some health issue. Self-employment. Didn't I say that? Some of you have business. It may not be doing well or it's doing well. And you want to transition into it full time. You may be doing it part time. Self-employment is highlighted here leaving some of you want to leave relationship leave job we're going to clarify this i think this reading is so um well put together it's, it's just like a, a in sync um you know if this resonates for you go ahead and purchase the extended reading it's two dollars i think this is probably as cheap as you can get right um if you feel like it resonates with you you want to kind of go a little bit further purchase the extended reading and um we're gonna drill down on these cards because i'm curious also with my moon being in labor okay um uh, so the link is below go ahead click that and um we're gonna see if this is about this is an interesting reading libra um okay there's 
opposing idea here. That's why it, it keeps you from making a change. Five talk about change you need to make. All right, anyhow, we'll go over to the other side. Thank you, Libra, for tuning in. Know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take advantage of the $5 yes or no um, reading. It's $5. Ask a yes or no question. Um, I'll send you some cards via email and, and um, an explanation of those cards. Uh, also, go ahead and get the extended reading or go over to the website and book um, your own personal reading so you can pull your own personal energy. Uh, it looks really, really good, Libra, for April. It's a lot of decision here. It's the ending, the culmination of you got to decide what you're doing now. Okay, so see you on the other side. Link below. Thank you. Bye.